Hey yo Captains, how's it going bros? So as some of you may remember that a few days ago, I posted a video with an announcement of our new series called What If. Now in this series, we'll be simulating anything you guys basically want to see and it should hopefully add some variety to the channel. And the second most popular choice for this video was, can a Boeing 747 take off with two engines? So here we are guys with a 747-400 we're just in the field to get to New York, so we have around 12,000 feet to take off with. Now engines 1 and 4 are fully disabled, so we only have our two middle engines, and our flaps are set to 10 degrees. Now we're passing 80 knots, and you can see we're about a third of the way down the runway. Now for some reason, it's hard to keep the aircraft on the center line. I'm not sure why this is, because our engines are fully balanced. And although you can't see it, the airspeed indicator is showing me that we're approaching VR, so I'm going to start to rotate now. Now that we've established a positive ray, I'm bringing the gear up. And it looks like we can keep the steady climb going and could land the plane if necessary. Now that was boring, so let's try this again. So in this one, we're going to try again with a 747 at maximum takeoff weight. So it'll be interesting to see how this will turn out. And also guys, you can still vote for new videos in the series by clicking the link in the description. Now you can definitely see we're accelerating slower and it's already pretty concerning just how slow we're going man. Our rate of acceleration is beginning to decrease as we have only have two engines and it's also very hard to keep the aircraft on the centre line and if we do take off, I think it'll be very hard to control the plane. Now our plane is very heavy and we could fly to Singapore with this amount of fuel although it wouldn't be good with just two engines. By the way, you can find more about this situation and some of the reasons for this result at Avgi. Now we're not at VR speed just yet, but I'm going to try and rotate because otherwise we'll overshoot the runway. In fact, we're barely over 100 knots and we need over 150 to take off safely. Now guys, I wonder what would happen if a 737 had to take off with just one engine. I'll probably try this in a future video, and as you can see, we're bouncing off the runway. We just about made it, yo. <laughs> now the aircraft is veering to the right, and it's hard to correct it as we're almost stalling, which makes us lose control of the aircraft. Although we probably could make it around to 10,000 feet. So guys, there's your answer. A 747 can take off our maximum takeoff weight with just two engines. Now my question to you is, did you expect that? Because I certainly didn't. Remember guys to leave your thoughts and your comments below and I'll see you in the next video.